Alan White. God bless him, man. I miss him already. He's a great guy. Uh, we did many events together, rock and roll fantasy camp. We actually played together several times and double drum stuff that was just insanely good. We also did the NAM show. David Harris would have the uh, NAM jam on a Friday night for a couple of years. We always had, had such a great time. But whenever I think of Alan, I think of the uh, 1972, I think it was. I was in Wings, I was in London. And we were recording in Morgan Studios, which was a rarity. We'd never been there. I don't know why we were there. I can't remember what we did. But Paul and I were out front having a smoke in between, taking a break, you know. And uh, all of a sudden, this beautiful white Bentley Fastback, an S3, I believe they were called, pulls up. It's all white, solid, white wall tires, white paint job white leather interior, white fur rugs. And in the driving it was uh, Alan White, dressed all in white with the long white hair. And uh, it was it was a sight to behold. I mean, he pulled up and Paul and I looked at each other and said, that's what a rock star looks like. <laughs> and it was fabulous. And uh, we probably exchanged a few words, but uh, uh, he was in session mode, and so were we. We just went back in, but I'll, I'll never forget that. It was a priceless moment. So God bless you, Alan. I hope your, your journey home is safe and, uh, and that you're, uh, you're out of, the, out of the, uh, the pain and the suffering of this life. So you left your mark with a lot of us. We love you.